Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Thomas here. It's gonna be a short one. So I got a couple hours to kill. So I figure I'm gonna go from Calgary and uh, on Plummer's Road and hoping that I'm gonna find some spots maybe even to fly the drone. Last week I made a video about Wakako Nano Press Espresso Maker that's a portable little coffee maker single shot or you can just pour, top it up with water and have a coffee while you're camping, hiking or biking doesn't really matter it's really portable, really small and uh, it brews a quality coffee something uh, that I really like uh, I like my coffee um, especially on a longer rides uh, it, when there is no coffee shops or nothing it's good to have a cup of cup of coffee in the morning if you want to check that video have a look on the videos what i posted last week and have a look at it if you missed it i'm really looking forward to more rides this year hopefully i gotta do some scuba diving as well because last year I only had a couple dives. I see some riders also chose that road. It's a very common drag for everyone to come out and for a short afternoon or morning ride if they're off work. There's like 40% chance of rain today. So our trip most likely to British Columbia. It's getting closer and closer. So hoping that trip is gonna be a lot of fun uh, usually yes like uh, we have a great group of guys uh, we're pretty close friends so we hang out on a regular basis and when we go riding together we always have a blast uh, we ride the whole day even in the evening we have a good time uh, whether it's a campsite recreational site or just a random camping location in Crownland or any area pretty much and we always uh, go together and 99% uh, of the time we do tent so we don't uh, we don't look for luxury uh, I don't even like to stay in a motel so I prefer my own sleeping bag or a mattress pad versus the hotel bed with possible bag bags, bed bags <laughs> no I'm kidding, I'm just kidding but uh, yeah I'm pretty sure some of those uh, you can find like that good time in the evening and uh, during the day we stop in a lot of many awesome places uh, to enjoy the beauty of this country and uh, down south in the states I still wish I could go to states unfortunately this, the restrictions are still holding us back
it's becoming windy, that's it for a great weather. As soon as I took out the drone, the wind started to pick up and that's pretty strong wind and I actually <laughs> crashed the drone but nothing happened thanks God. I was li I lucked out on this one. That's the second time that drone uh, Mavic Air 2 survived the crash. Uh, this time uh, the wind pushed it sideways against the tree and uh, it's got sensors but not on the side sensors. <laughs> That's a bummer but what can you do? Well the good thing is that nothing happened not even propellers got damaged. That's what happens when you don't pay attention and that's like a second time when I was riding to here, through here I, I passed this turn, I don't know why it's, uh, it's like there's no signs, it's kind of uh, and I'm not even looking at the GPS even though the location is entered <laughs> Learn and live, a couple more times and I'll get it right I guess Yesterday uh, I was able to do some work on a bike I changed the oil and filter so she's uh, completely open for a season and uh, during winter I did all the other maintenance I even adjusted the valves this year so now since I took care of the baby I hope she's gonna take care of me throughout the season Just don't let me down we are planning uh, quite a bit of riding Gotta take some side roads different uh, way than usually I go. I went here a couple of weeks ago with my daughter. This way. It's actually a very nice ride through the countryside. Calgary downtown over there in the distance I wouldn't mind to fly the drone a little bit more but not with those winds I'm not gonna risk it it's too much wind whoa that was slippery that's a loose gravel and I slammed the brake on the corner uh, too much What is this? I would only know. I wonder what that is. It's some kind of a playground and so this is it for today's ride time to wrap it up and I'll see you guys on the next ride cheers for now